It's a special video for Guard Your Eyes, the Oilam, the Chevre, it's a Mishpacha. What an amazing name, Guard Your Eyes. And I want to tell you about the Koyach of Eyes. The Koyach of Re'iya, you know, this week's Parsha coming up, is Parsha's Re'ez, Rosh Chodesh. Listen to the power of Re'ei. Everyone that's struggling, and there's no one that's not struggling, everyone at different levels. The Kli Yaka says, there's two parts. There's the physical Eretz you saw that you acquire through action. But then there's a spiritual part. And specifically, Yerushalayim Yerakoidesh, the Mokam Amigdash, says the Kli Yaka, when you look at it, Miyad Nislabesh, you immediately close yourself with an incredible spiritual change. Now, could I to look at the exact Lashon? Powerful language that the Kliyaka uses. But he's telling us that with one little vision, we could transform ourselves. Now, you know what that means? It's telling us what an incredible power we have with our vision. What an incredible gift the Rebbe gave us that when we look at good things, there's other places that you look and it has a transformation. Nail, candles. Say, especially when it's Hanukkah. But you know that shows us that, yeah, of course, it goes as an equilibrium. There's a negative. We look at something that we're not supposed to. It has an effect. But wow, if we could look at something negative and it has a negative effect, well, that means when we look at something positive, it has a positive effect. So much that Kliyaka is saying that there are times, there are places the Rebbe Hashem gave us in this world, the Makam Amigdash, where we could transform ourselves completely, make ourselves so pure. So Pasha Sra'e going into this Chodesh of El with Anila Daidi Vedaiduli, a person, everyone, has to be feeling a sense of despair. We could make a hundred mistakes a hundred a million times and we could look at something we're not supposed to and it has an effect on us but then we have the ability to look at something kaddish to look at a tzaddik look what chazal say about looking at a tzaddik there's yushalmi that describes how things with the rebbe who said that when he saw her, if he was able to see her maybe just the back so what i think we could take from this is that look for things that are kaddish because it has power it has a transformation and if negative things have negative impacts on us, positive looks. Looking at someone, a tzaddik, looking at a mokam amigdash, looking at a gemara, looking at the psukim, looking at the Torah when it's being picked up, the Mishnah already quotes, that you could have a transformation from that. And those opportunities to be the ones that we're focused on. And Havai, Rabbi should give us a schus, that our eyes should be so pure, should be purified. Our neshama should be purified, but especially I think in this month, it's Mesugal. Parshas Rei begins, Chodesh El, Hashem says, listen, Ani Melech Pasada, I'm out there in the field, speak to me. Try to look at all the pure things that Hashem has given us and it transforms everything to the degree, don't forget, that true Me'ava, Zdoinus Nasa Kizachis, I mean, you could change all those negative visions that you ever saw and somehow, that becomes a schus. Thank you for listening to the Guard Your Eyes Daily Chizuk Broadcast. Pass them on to your friends and help spread Kedusha in the world.